L-shaped winder tool. Uh, an L-shaped winder tool is a uh, ability to create stairs in adjacent walls. So let's go up to our architecture tab. Let's go over to our circulation panel. Let's hit the stair, the split button. Let's go to stair by component. We're going to come over here to the modify create stairs tab. We're going to slide over until we hit the L-shaped winder. A winder is a trapezoid stair that can change the direction of the stairs, in this case in an L shape. So let's click on it. It builds the stairs. We pick where we want the location line. Currently we're running down the center, but we can also choose the exteriors uh, or the run left or the run right, etc. We're going to go with the center. We can set the relative base height, the axle run. By default it's three feet. and but most times we'll go with four feet. We can create an automatic landing. We pick where we start the center line of the stairs and it builds the stairs going up to the second level and if we want to flip the stairs we can hit the space bar or we can come up to tools and we can hit flip and it will flip it the other direction. We can do that as many times as we want and uh, so once we're done with that, we have to do the finish edit mode. And let's take a look at it in 3D. And I got it to uh, zoom extents on this thing. So I'm going to zoom all the fit. And there's my stairs. And I'm going to go down and make sure my visual style isn't realistic. And now I can see what it looks like. Um, so I have the stairs are already built as an assembly and it creates the, the railings.